So guys, let's get started with the how I'm acquiring customers um, using data from Yell, um, how I get the data from Yell in a mass amount of data, and then how we market those people um, at scale as well. So we're gonna be starting off by showing you a product which I use, which is called Data Miner. Now Data Miner will work on any website and you can either build your own scripts or there are scripts that other people have made or they're, ca they're called recipes on there. Um, so we're gonna be using Yell. Um, and the reason for using Yell is there are a lot of tradespeople on there. One of the key areas that my businesses target is tradespeople. So it could be plumbers, electricians, anybody who is typically a sole trader operating on their own. And the reason I approach these guys first is because I find that they are really, you know, they want the extra help. They want a virtual assistant. So um, I'm going to show you it in action. So if I click on um, electricians, which I was doing recently, let's start with going after Manchester electricians, press search. So as you can see here, I've got, um, you know, a bunch of electricians. I like to do it based on distance. You get a lot of ads on Yell. Um, so if we have a look here, we've got 10 pages, right? So one, two, three, all the way to 10. It only shows you the first 10, so it's always good to keep it local. You might do more specifically. You might do like Stockport, Bradbury, whatever. Um, but you can see here, I basically have a bunch of electricians near Manchester, um, which I'm going to be able to target. So I'm going to be opening up. So you can obviously go to dataminer.io. This will give you um, the, 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 the web scraping tool. Um, you do have to pay for it, um, but you, there are free versions as well. I'm not affiliated with them in any way. Um, but this is the only data scraping tool that I'm aware of uh, that works so seamlessly on any website. So I think you do get like a hundred free and then you can buy more. Um, so use the free version to start with. So I'm going to come over to here. Um, obviously the plugins are already in some of these. So I can open up data miner and it will open it up from here. There's a bunch of ones which already exist, um, which I can use. Um, so I think the one that I've used before, maybe is this list from 2019. I'll just press play on this. Uh, bear me one second. So if I head back over to um, my Yelp page and I click on um, data scraper here, so I can open up their plugin, make sure you have the plugin installed. Um, and it'll basically bring up a already available public recipes. Um, I think one of the one that I've used before is this Yelp list 2019. So I simply press play and it will pull up the list and straight away I have the entire first page of data. Um, as you can see here, I have the company name and I have a number as well. Obviously, some of these are landlines, which is what we don't want, but we're going to filter through that afterwards. But straight away, I have now a good solid list. So I can do next page automation um, and there's 10 pages in total. I'm just going to reduce that down to six and I just press scrape. And that is going to go through those 10 pages of um oh, what's that? Be so I think there's 25 on each page. That's 250 we should end up with. Um, as you can see here, it's gone to the next page already. So great, it's gonna go through that. So give that a couple of minutes to load through. All the solid data. I mean, it even gives you distance, they're full of dress, which is good if, you, if you're kind of building up a CRM, you can target them if you know you wanna make sure that, okay, what category they're in, electricians, you can put that into your own CRM for monitoring the people that you're going through. I don't know if you use Go High Level, but there's a great um, CRM for you to kind of doing your outreach and keeping an eye on it as well. You can also do your text messages from Go High Level, which is a really good way of um, nurturing these people and making them become clients. Um, one of the great things about this is the, what I find is at, with outreach, it is a numbers game, okay? You can write the best sales email, you can write the best um, message, whatever it might be, but the number one key is volume, right? The more people you outreach to, the more people that are gonna come back to you. Um, yes, you could spend more time kind of building out chatbots, which is one another, another approach. You could build a chatbot uh, for one of, one of your customers to try before they even paid you. You can scrape their data from their, um, from their website using these, um, sort of chatbot websites, there's, there's, there's so many of them, which we talk about a lot in our group. Um, but anyway, here we go. So 250, I think there's one more page because I think it's probably double the first one. Great, that's done. Now watch this. So that's 275, I think there's actually 250, but we just press download and I want to bring that up in an Excel file. Um, yell, electricians, great, that's done. And by the way, you can keep going back and adding to that same list. So I could do Manchester and go, right, I'm going to go after Liverpool. I'm going to do London, whatever it might be. Um, and you can add them all to the same list. So let me just try and open up this thing now. Here we go. Uh, so I'm going to the page. Here we go. Right. 
So, so to make sure that you can see this all, I can see here, obviously I've got the company name, I've got the phone numbers as well, and that's really what I need to start with. Um, let me just, the first thing we wanna do with our list, now that we've downloaded it, sorry, I'm just making it easy for you to see. Um, now we've got our list, go into our phone numbers, we wanna sort and filter them, um, and what we don't wanna, we wanna basically do this, we wanna do, um, not color, we wanna do, Sorry, sort and filter is the right one. Custom sorts, yeah, expand the selection. No, sorry, I'm in the wrong thing here altogether. It's normally here. Sort and, ah, I think I might just need to do this. Yes, begins with, sorry. Um, so sort and filter, and then you wanna do begins with, and then just literally 07, thing we yell is they don't have like the plus or four or anything like that, which is great. So we just do plus or four, sorry, just begins with 07, apply that filter, and then that's done. We wanted to copy them all, because it's just filtered at the moment, they've not actually got rid of them, and paste it into our new um, sheet down at the bottom. And then again, we have now um, all these mobile numbers, and a grand total of 157. So it's taken off about 125 people. So these are all now mobile numbers. Now, what do we do with these? Um, people, but they're all electricians. So that's all our target market, which we're going to go to them and we're going to sell them um, a chatbot to start with. Hey, you know, you're an electrician. I've actually have a pre-made template, which I'll show you now. Here we go. Um, I hope you don't mind my direct message. I'm reaching out to local electricians to see if they'll be interested in integrating an AI powered chatbot on your website and WhatsApp. I understand that as an electrician, it's important to pre-qualify customers. So it's, it's, it's a nice outreach. It's, it's, it is a cold outreach, but I'm trying to make it sound as personal as possible. You know, I hope you don't mind my direct message when I'm sending the direct message to a thousand people. Fine. Um, I'm reaching out to local electricians. I'm telling them that I know what industry they're in. Um, you know, once you do something else, once you do plumbers, great. You can put that message in there as well. Now you're probably thinking, right, how am I going to send all of these text messages? Um, now, what we need to do is we have a platform which is built in onto, bear me one second. Let me just see whether I can get rid of this. Here we go. So now we head over to the WhatsApp and I use another plugin, which again is completely free, which is great. Um, this one is called Rocket Sender. And all I do with Rocket Sender is, I love Rocket Sender. It's, it's it, bear me one second, I'll put it up now. All we have to do is enter all the phone numbers. So literally as simple as, actually start from here. And we just copy those. So I'm just copying every single one of the phone numbers. I come over here, I enter that. Uh, let's close that, don't need that. And then it asks for the message that I wanna send. Great, I have my pre-recorded message, which by the way, if you guys wanna copy this message, it's a really nice um, outreach, um, especially for selling chatbots, feel free to use it. Uh, we do give you all the scripts and outreach and platforms to use. This is just one of the many that we that we recommend to you. So if you're interested in getting involved um, in our program, you can, I will leave a link for a WhatsApp uh, which will come straight through to me so we can have a conversation about you starting your very own AI agency. Um, so yeah, let's copy this message over, paste that in there. And it's literally that simple. I hope you don't mind me reaching out, has the message in there. And then this will t ask you, okay, how, how, what's the delay that you want to have between sending the message? Um, and so you can, you can, the thing is, if you're leaving this on all day, it will, it will literally just send all day. So you can put this at like you know, anywhere between 10 seconds and maybe like 30 seconds or even just, you know, three and four seconds, whatever. I think it's always good to have a, a nice delay and you just press send and it will start to do your outreach. Now I'm going to stop it because it's half past eight here and getting a text message, selling you a chatbot on a Sunday night at half past eight, is probably not the best thing. So but you get the idea, it's that simple. All you have to do is have that WhatsApp, which is Rocket Reach, and then using Data Miner to get your contacts. And then you can use platforms like Yell. You can also use other ones like Check a Trader um, or Trust a Trader, I think is the other one. They're really good for getting contact details. Um, I'm gonna be releasing more um, of these tutorials, um, especially one for an 
Airbnb, I think is a big one for people. Um, people who have Airbnbs, it's really good for them to have a chatbot where you know you get customers coming through and you don't want to have to deal with them every single time. It'll do all of that for them. Um, so yeah, this is about you building up a big amount of customer base with your AI powered chatbots. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe for future ones as well. Thanks guys, take care.